Life without you just don't feel the same All I'm feeling is major pain I don't know why you had to go But girl, please come back, don't leave me all alone Yo, what it do is your boy MGZ King And I'm back on your screen I hope everybody has a great, amazing day I'm walking to the store real quick Now I feel out of breath already Yeah, I got my hair like this Because I'm going to come back and cut it so that's why I didn't want to fix it too much, but I just put this thing on here. Um, my my goddaughter's big sister gave it to me, so I'm like, since she knows this is one of my favorite colors. And um, so I was like, I'm gonna throw it on, so I threw it on. <laughs> and I actually pretty much like it. <laughs> uh, but anyway, so yeah, I'm walking to the store and I will see y'all in a bit though because I am jamming out and I might record while I'm in there so I'm walking the clothes section so yeah chill I'm already out of clothes you guys I didn't vlog in there because I just went in and out uh yes yeah I'm right there but yeah anyway so uh, I'm gonna go ahead and walk back home and I'll see y'all in a bit of a Yo, what up, squad? I'm right here chilling at the crib. I just got done cutting my hair. Check that out. Put the cross right there. Ooh, you know what I'm saying? Whew. I feel like a million bucks once again. Hey, gotta throw the foil. Gotta throw the foil. Yeah, I already know. If you know, you know. My lucky number is four. And I'm just right here. I'm just chilling. I just got done cutting my hair, taking a shower, all that good stuff. Um, My little brother's having school, but he came in here to get his notebook, so I'm thinking he's having art or something. I don't know. <laughs> uh, yeah, I got home. I ate my mommy's um, tacos of egg and ham, huevo y jamón. And yeah, and my bad if I do, like, you know what I'm saying? Uh, for all my, all my raza out there. Perdón, si no me entienden, si nomás dicen que hablo puro inglés y no sé qué, no sé cuánto, pero inglés sí es mi primera lang lenguaje y me disculpen. What I just said is I apologize to all my people out there that speak Spanish. Like, sometimes they be like, ah, oh, you act like you don't speak Spanish. It's not that I don't act, it's just that English is my first language. And um, I speak more English. Like, I speak Spanish, but I don't speak it perfect. I speak it, like, you could say it's the slang way. Like, I told y'all before this. But I don't want my people to think that, oh, I just, you know, I'm acting too good that I don't speak Spanish. Like, heck nah, I speak Spanish when I have to, you know. Uh, but, you know, English is literally my first language. Um, born and raised in Dallas, Texas, and. I don't forget the where my roots come from, though. You know, um, I, I'll never forget where my roots are from. You know, uh, I speak Spanish. Um, I do speak Spanish a lot, though. When I'm off camera, I speak Spanish a lot. Cause I speak Spanish to my dad, and I speak English to him as well. So I speak English and Spanish, but mostly, usually when we talk, we talk most more in Spanish, and when my mom is more English. And then, like, when my goddaughter's a grandma, she speaks nothing but Spanish, so I speak to her in Spanish. So I do speak Spanish a lot on a day-to-day -day basis, but it just, I'm sorry, like, you know, I don't really record when I do speak Spanish. Uh, maybe I need to start speaking a little bit of both, Spanish and English, you know what I'm saying? Uh, uh, but yeah. Y lo que dije es que me corté el pelo, hoy ya me cortó el pelo. Me corté el pelo, me puso una cruz aquí. Y, pues sí, um, today is April the 1st. Hey, where are all my Aries at? Because, you know what I'm saying? My birthday is coming up. <laughs> Dab on them. <laughs> my birthday is Sunday, which is, what, two days and a half probably now to my birthday. Um, I'm excited because it's on Easter. And I'm just, I'm thrilled. <laughs> Uh, 
Shout out, you know. Shout out to everybody. I have I've been having people, even my doctors tell me happy birthday. One of my doctors told me happy birthday today. The other one told me happy birthday the day before yesterday. And you know, they know my birthday's coming up, so um I have a few people that have been telling me happy birthday, even like a few people on TikTok, on Instagram, whatnot. So thank y'all. I appreciate it so much from the bottom of my heart. Honestly, I really do. Tomorrow is actually my bro's birthday. He's going to be 29. My bro, y'all seen him before in my videos. My bro Q. Cubo, he's about to be um, 29. And I'm about to be 32. And yeah, you know what I'm saying? Um... I've been posting a lot of stuff, like, you know, that only makes sense on my, like, Snapchat and, like, on my Instagram. And it's not to, you know, make anybody feel some type of way. Hold on, yeah, I'm gonna move while I'm recording for them. Oh, yeah, like I was saying, it's not for anybody to feel any type of way. It's just, you know, um, I've been seeing a lot of butterfly stuff and stuff, and I always have liked the butterflies, and a butterfly always reminds me of my mother for some reason. A butterfly always reminds me of my mother. And I even tell her, like, it's every time, it's like a butterfly reminds me of you. Um, and um, I guess because my mom had been through a lot of stuff when she was younger, and it just reminds me of growth, you know? You go through, it's like, for instance, you go through relationships and you know basically like on my end it's like i've been through relationships and relationships it's like it's been something scary that i was like you know what i'm never gonna get in a relationship ever again and what happened i got in one same thing happened and it's like i ain't never gonna get in one again and it just kept continuing for me to get in relationships because i feel like just because one person hurt me, just because two, three, four, five, ten, twenty, whatever the situation, the number is hurt me. I know there's one out there that's not going to hurt me and that's actually going to love me, understand me. And, you know, we're going to we're going to click like that. You know, I, I, you know, so it's like I was just like, all right, whatever. Um. So a butterfly to me represents a growth, you know, because what happens? It's a, it's a, cat. what is it, a caterpillar, then it's, no, a cocoon, and then it flies into a butterfly, whatever, you know what I'm saying? I think that's how it is. If it's wrong, I apologize. <laughs> but, um, yeah, you know, um, it's just, it's a growth. So, you know, I have been posting some stuff like yesterday, and it was not, like, to make anybody feel bad or like oh this and this and that like no it's just you know I've been hurt and you know uh, sometimes you gotta get hurt you know in order to find that the right one or you know to to end up in the right path of where you're at you know for me having PTSD and all the stuff that I've been going through life's been hard it's been really hard um you know, I try with every female that I ever been with, I just try to give them my all. And what I give back, nothing. All I got was a slap in the face and a F you and they turned their back on me. So is that like, you know, it's cool. I ain't tripping no more. Like it is what it is, you know, you live and you learn and you just grow from it. Um so you know When you less suspect it, trust me that somebody's going to come in your life. I know I'm telling you. Uh, and, you know, when you have that somebody, just show them, just show them that you're going to be there no matter what. It is gonna, you know, y'all going to be strong together. And because it's like being with somebody. It's not oh it's not about just you no more. It's not just about me no more. No, it's 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 a it's a team thing. And if you can't work by a team thing, then obviously you ain't meant to be for dating or you just haven't found the right one, I guess, you know, cuz there's a lot of guys out there that I know that you know, they let the girls go here, go there, and they don't care. But why they don't care? Because they're out there doing they doing their thing, you know what I'm saying? And by doing their thing, yo, you know what I mean when I'm saying they doing their thing. Not all guys, though. 
there's some guys that are you know like me for instance um, I'm chill I'm laid back I'm cool hey if you want to go go you know what I'm saying it is what it is some people be, might be seeing this video and be like, oh, bullshit, you get mad or not. Yeah, I do. Sometimes I will get mad. Sometimes, you know, because I, I intend to end up being the jealous type because of all the bull crap that all these females put me through. And because I never was a jealous type until all these females started putting me through all this bull crap. And I guess, too, because back in the day, I didn't take females as serious because I was just a teenager, whatever, you know, just I was just exploring. And as I got older, I'm like, okay, what the heck, you know, like, this, this ain't how it's supposed to be. This ain't how the game go, you know. Um, but, yeah, so all I can say is if you've been hurt, don't put it off or don't be like, oh, I'm going to be a player now, this and this and that, I'm going to go cheat. Especially to my fellas, don't be like that. Because that's why a lot of women are the way they are because of how a lot of guys are towards them. They treat them like crap. They do this, they do that. But that's what I don't understand. When a female has a dude like me and they lie, it's like they want to sit there and they want to act shady in some other type of way. It's like, what the heck? But I'm like, I guess, you know, I guess you just ain't the right one. <laughs> I don't know. Um, so, yeah, but, you know, my thing's just been about basically growth and stuff. That's what my, my, my um, Snapchats and my instagram's been about um everybody wants to know who you talking to yada, yada, yada. trust me if you know you know like i ain't gotta say no names if i don't want to speak on if i am in a relationship and i don't want to speak on it there's a reason why i don't want to speak on it you know what i'm saying um why well, probably come this time if i am in a relationship uh like yeah i'll post her but i'm just trying to keep things more like between me and her if i most understand myself but i'm not a, i'm not afraid to show off who i'm with but i'm not gonna bitch to sit there and be like oh yeah that's my girl or this and this and that yada yada yeah but you know i just learned that when it comes to being in a relationship sometimes it's better to you know just stay low-key and y'all do y'all, because that's the only way it's going to be, you know, you're going to be happy and stuff by doing y'all. And forget what everybody else says, honestly. But yeah, anyways, though, um, I can't wait for y'all to see the music video. Man, oh man, it's already ready to go. I just need the fourth to come on, and it's going to be, it's going to be, you know what I'm saying? It's going to be, a, it's going to be a wrap. <laughs> uh there's some parts that I was like, it kind of iffy about, but I tried to fix it the best way I could, but I really couldn't. Well, Cause the sun was shining so bright and the spot where we were at, the sun was just hitting so bad. So, you know, it was like, damn. But I liked it though. I really did. I liked it. I liked the scenery where I picked that and stuff. It's just something beautiful and so nice. Uh, I was supposed to have, uh, girl with me in the video but she ended up having anxiety and all this stuff and was nervous so i was like you know it's cool i ain't tripping um hopefully for the next video when i shoot a new video for one of my new song my newer songs that'll be in in the next works coming i will hopefully have a female by then in the video um but yeah, thanks for all the love and support, though. And I will literally see y'all back in the group, though. Chill. I do. I hope everybody had a great, amazing day. Um, thanks for all the love and support. And I hope everybody had a great, amazing day. So don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe. Join the team and join the squad. And I will most definitely see y'all tomorrow. Tomorrow is Good Friday. So much love. God bless. And I'm out. Chill. Things that gon' turn you on Hope you feel the vibe when you hear this song You a boss, I'm a boss too Lil' baby, when I pull it, would you go?